Hello guys, hello ladies and gentlemen. I'm Ruben again. Eh, eh, you know guys, when you are learning other language, it is uh, really difficult to find other things for speaking because you 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 can speak a few words in English. You you don't have a, a good vocabulary, and for more that that you that you want to speak about other other topics and to speak about many things, that is difficult. It is very complicated. Come on, because you don't have good language, you need to improve more. Because you don't have a good language. Okay, guys, I I hope make other video in other occasion. Okay, guys. So, ah, uh, and this week I'm gonna uh, study about uh, irregular verbs because this is an. Uh, Harry, thanks for me. I need to study like the the next form, like that. Here, the present, the past, and past participle. Uh, I I want to, to to learn about break, break and speak. It's a a little bit simple, uh, irregular verbs, but I need to 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 start speaking about that because they are uh, here. Here I have uh, seven groups. I need to study like this from my next uh, studies in English, okay? Wait. I break, I break the wall with the hammer. I break the wall, I break the wall with the hammer. I speak English very good in the present and the past is I broke my hands yesterday. I broke my hands yesterday. Here I spoke English in the meeting yesterday. On the other hand, I have the past participle. Particip past participle. I have broke. I have broken my coat alone. I have broke. I have broke my coat alone. I have broke. I have broke in the in the past participle. I have. I have spoken, I have spoken, I have, I have broken, I have spoken, lowly, lowly in this video.